and it's going to be the newly crowned World Junior Champion, Amina Orphy, taking on Team USA's number one player, Carolyn Fouts. She can gain confidence right now. Orphy just blitzing through the American. Yeah, it's a great line from Orphy. Really sharp. Movement Six sharp, the hitting long. sharp. Nine game balls here for Orphe now. Been on a real mission here, Orphe. She's given Carolyn Fouts very little around the middle of the court. She's really taken time away from Fouts as well with the volley. Not up. Yeah, it's aggressive from Carolyn Fouts. The massive fist pump in, in Orphe's direction. She's a little bit frustrated, Fouts, that she's not getting particularly clear to lines to the ball. Yeah, really accurate there from Morphy. It's a good finish from the Egyptian. Clever there from Orphy. She let the ball just settle all the way into the middle and whipped yeah, in the referee. Not having any of it though, so we're playing on. Yeah, Orphy's absolutely pile drive that ball into the back corner. Really accurate there, Vandrick. Yeah, she perhaps even could have asked for a stroke there, but instead choosing. Interesting that Caroline Fouts choosing to serve from the left side whenever she gets the hand out. Yeah, she must feel that Orphy is a little bit dangerous with the cross-court nick attempts on the backhand. It's good response there from Carolyn Fouts. She really let that rally develop a little bit more. Waited for Orphy to settle and then flicked her cross court. Massive response from the American. It's been a pretty spicy second game, Vandrick. There's been quite a lot of contacts and massive fist pumps. Yeah, and Carolyn Fouts rocketing that ball out of court. Yeah, that's sharp work from Orphy. She's really whipped that one in. Orphy just really quashed the, the resurgence from the American. Just the hitting of Orphy has been so direct and so accurate.
Yeah, Orphy's got Fouts on the run here. She's made the court really big there, Orphy. Fouts starting to run out of ideas here. She's just not finding a way to. American. The ball clips out, and Amina Orphy taking that first match. And we have the runner-up from last week's individual competition, Fairuz Abulkir, taking on the USA number two, Ria Navani. Very sharp from our work here. She was smart Three, to the fact wow. that uh, using the height of the front wall. Really good to see from uh, Navani just to change things up and um, really mixing things up. And unfortunately, that did sail out, but uh, nice variety and skills from uh, Navani. And yeah, it's a good shutout here from Navani. She's gobbled up that short ball from the first game of this second rubber for Egypt. Yeah, it's a great finish from Abulkir. Yeah, uh, Navani needs to be careful here. Um, the first game, Abulkir ran away with it um, after the early exchanges, and seemingly the same thing could happen here. A lovely volley drop and brings one back. Uh, so just hanging in there, cutting the deficit to two. Yeah, lots of exchanges up high up on the court, but Abulkir just winning the points at the back as well, showing. The good old, you know, nothing like a good length and uh, will put pressure, if not win you the point, but definitely give you an advantageous position. Oh, it's a great get there from Abelkir. That was good. Yeah, I'm not sure Navani's going to get much joy on this decision. Yeah, just a little too good there. Battling here, Navani. She's trying to find chinks in Abelkir's armor, but there really isn't much. And she just needs to find a way to get Abelkir deeper in the court. Great line from Abelkir. So Abelkir inching closer to the finish line here for Egypt. Quality of shot throughout that rally and a two point lead. Might be her first lead in the match actually. Really accurate there from Abelkir. Right box, please. She's starting to sense she's she's getting close. Yeah, what a Seven beautiful beautiful drop to take the. Oh, and there it is. Yeah, there it is. Fairuz Abelkir takes this world team title for Egypt. A phenomenal performance from the Egyptian women's team.